We will consider President Buhari over other northerners for presidency in 2019, Igbo youth. To show their support for the re-election of President Muhammadu Buhari in 2019, the World Igbo Youth Congress, WIC, said they would embark on one million man march to Asu Rock this month, Vanguard reports. Nage. Com gathered that WIC, however vowed to stop the re-election of Governor Rakaz Ikbizu of Abia State in 2019. The group Seik Pizu has continued to suffer workers and pensioners of the state by owing them months of arrears of their entitlements. The Youth Congress in a statement signed by its National Publicity Officer, Mazi Alex Akumari, said after consultation with Igbo youth stakeholders, we decided to march to Aso Rock and demand that President Buhari should run for second tenure. We will support Buhari with bloc votes from the southeast. Even majority of members of the Ohans and Igbo have given us their support that President Buhari is more credible than agents of restructuring and that President Buhari has only four years to hand over to an Igbo man in 2023. Ndigbo will support Buhari if he rehabilitates all roads in southeast, and support SME businesses. The World Igbo Youth Council will consider President Buhari over other northerners for presidency in 2019. The group scored Abia state governor, Akazik Pizupor, adding that, World Igbo Youth Council will officially present an award to the governor as the face of bad governance and worst seven overner on December 10, 2017, in Amueya. Wake listed Kpizu's sins to include, non-payment of workers' salaries and pension, his made in ABBA products promotion campaign as a fraud. He, allegedly, uses the campaign of made in ABBA products to establish a secret company in China, and uses the scheme to, allegedly, launder funds through his aides, and that is why he has no control over some of his new aides, especially those from Obinwa. His open weeds are richer than Abia State and will be dragged to the EFCC by January, to know how they acquired over half of the choices properties in Abba and Amueya. Kpizu has collapsed all the infrastructure in Abia, without constructing any major road in Abia, rather he is hiding under the governor's forum to demand for federal government intervention in federal roads in Abia. Kizu has been caged by his beer parlor noids, and when he loses election, Obingwa people will stone him, he should emulate Mugabe and resign and hand over to his deputy. In a previous report by Nage. Com, Aziwa Jubola Ahmed Tinubu revealed that the All Progressives Congress, APC, will follow due democratic process in selecting its presidential candidate for the 2019 elections. The Punch reports that the APC leader spoke on Wednesday, November 22 shortly after his meeting with leaders of the pan Europe socio-cultural organization, the Afnafir, at the residence of the leader of the organization, PA. Ruben Facerandi in Acure, Ondo State. 